person in the room, you're in the wrong damn room. <laughs> and you can learn from anybody. You know what I mean? Master the art of listening. So don't do so much talking as you do listening. If you listen, a person will tell you exactly what's on their heart and their mind. All you got to do is listen. Like that. All you got to do is just listen. Really? Tell me more. Really? For real? Just tell. And people love to talk. They love to brag. And this is how you, you learn their weaknesses. They're just by listening to what they say. I, I'm a little bitty guy. You, you, you'll probably be taller than Pops. Mm -hmm. You know how I've won? I've only, I didn't lose a fight. The last fight I had, I tied. I didn't whoop him. You told me Tookie whooped. You told me he. No, no, no. This is when I was in prison. Oh, I thought you were talking about the Tookie that, fight. The prison fight was the last fight I had. Oh, but the first, the big one that you well, took. Yeah, you told me he got you. <laughs> he didn't really get me. You know what I mean? It, it, it's like he swung at me. I, I dug back, hit my head on the glass. I came back. And, and when I came back, this reflex train, mm -hmm. this reflex, it was like, ping, ping. And I right. hit it so quick, he stumbled back. And he went, ha, ha, ha. Laughed at church. Oh, oh, see. <laughs> and, and, and that was it. That's crazy. The last fight I had. You, you know, it, it was it was basically a draw because they broke us up. The, the thing is, is that you train, you train, you train until it becomes second nature. You know, it, it, it's like before each game, you would meditate. You close your eyes and you could see the kickoff. You could see the pass. You could see you running into the end zone. You could see you making that tackle. If you see it, if you visualize it, you are manifesting. If you can see it, it will become reality. And this is when you block everything out. You block the noise, you block the cheerleaders, you block the teammates, and you get into yourself. And, and that's when H2O comes out, the dragon comes out. That's when all of these other entities inside of you come out. And you will become a god on that football field. But it's inside of you. You, you got to do it. Me and Pop can do it. It's inside of you. Mm -hmm. you know, and you're a natural at this. But now we, we go to the next level. So that's why I say, when, when you get back, cut all the lights out and listen. Master the art of listening. If, if the wind blows, you move. If, if, if the car, you move. Any sound, you, you move. And, and that way you can anticipate which way it's coming because you become with your locks. You become one with nature. The wind, the sun, everything will tell you which way that he's going to go. But you've got to be at one with nature. Did that make any sense with you? You've got to feel the grass as long as it ain't astral dirt. If it's natural, you can communicate with it. Mm -hmm. Everything that is alive has a spirit. Your dredge will lock you into the spirit that are natural. Trust me, I used to play sports. This is where the phone, the phone was and nobody ever take my shit. You caught it right away though. They think I'm old and senile. You I'm is smart. You ain't my brain is the last thing. I am super intelligent. And that's what scares people. When you show people that you are smart and you are a thinker and you're not just this big dumb jock, mm -hmm. when you have intelligence. People will respect you and they will fear you. will cross over from respect to fear. Mm -hmm. I, I'm, you just watch. You just you watch. You watch. You watch. Ten, your eight. Eight is the number of, re, uh, of repetition, re, re, repeatedness. Nine is the number of strength. When you turn nine, everything will become strength. Ten is the number of God. And then the numbers repeat again. One, one. 11, 1, 1, right? So the, the number system only goes up to 10. And then it starts all over. And I'll, I'll slowly teach you about, about numbers and how to read them and, and what's going to go on with that too. So, you know, Pops trains the body. I, I train the mind and we'll both train your soul. Mm -hmm. You'll be the ultimate warrior. You like that? All right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Come on, help, help me here, D. 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 Being D. D. dirty. Yeah, okay. Being right. dirty. Yeah. So, so there's a game tackle. Everybody's on top of you. 
and somebody will stick their fingers in your face mask to blind you. They'll pull your lip, you know, that, that type of old bullshit to get your mind off the fucking game. You know what I mean? We don't do that. We, we, no, because we are the... You do that to me once, I'll do it to you 110 times. I'll, I'll dig your grandmama up and do it. <laughs> Out the grave. It's just a mentality that you got to have. When you're on that gridiron, it is a battlefield. You are there to win. And you will win it all. The Raiders' motto was just win, baby. From Jack Taylor, the assassin, the man. In order for you to survive that particular day, you've got to be the most feared, most respected player on the field. And, and, and we'll train you. We'll, we'll teach you step by step. We'll, we'll teach you. But I need that. When I look in your eyes, I see this fire. You, you got this fire. And, and I don't really know what it is right now. But it's going to come out of you. And it may come out on, on, on the field. But, but there is... This is what I see when I see you. See this? It's a five-headed dragon that spits fire. One of my best friends. You really can do that? Mm hmm? You really can do that? You really can do that? No. No. But you can. Ah! But you right. can. You can. That's just a symbol. But you are a living, breathing dragon. That, that's where that flash, that flash comes in. So sometimes you might have to shift shape. You might have to change from just being a football player or being flash or being 2.0, which is water, and to being a fucking dragon. It depends on your opponent. What your opponent gives you and shows you, you counteract that. So if he shows you fire, cross his ass with water. You have all of those components. You have all of those weapons inside of you. And when you read your opponent, you'll know which weapon to go up against him to win the battle. What we're teaching you, the art of war. The art of war, listen, this is very important. The art of war dictates and says, he who doesn't fire a single shot actually wins the battle. So when you come on that field and they heard of your reputation, your legacy of what you can do, it's over. They're already saying, what the fuck, they already gave up. They don't want no phone, they don't want no smoke. And you want to set that precedence. You've already got it because they call you a phenom. But now we go to the next level. Because now, instead of you chasing him down on the field, you anticipate him coming this way and then cutting back. Bam. It's like, y'all play chess. That, that football field is nothing but a chess game. So, you know, I mean, your body is already developing. Now we're developing the mind. The last thing is we develop the spirit. The last thing is the spirit. Tell them, Pop. I, I built that theater uh, back in a uh, hundred years ago. What is called? <laughs> uh, back, back when I did the pyramids in the. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was a Magic Johnson Theater. It was a Magic Johnson Theater. Now it's, it's, it's called the Rave. But we built that. We built the Taco Bell right there, Michelle's. That was called Fat Burgers. We built that. Oh, yeah, too. Fat Burgers. Yeah, we, we right built there. the Fat Burgers. That's what they did the movie at, huh? At this Fat Burger right here, right? The uh, uh, John Singleton, right? Yeah. The Boys yeah. in the Hood, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Where, where, they got, where they shot the. Uh, I mean, where they. Went to the hammer and shot the fools. Yeah, that's right. That's yeah. Right. If you're not willing to take that light, don't, don't be playing and flashing and, and trying to intimidate. No, because he might have a gun. And if he has a gun, he damn sure will take your life. Right. You, know, you only pull a gun unless you're willing, you're willing to squeeze that trigger and take a life. Go a step further, a, a warrior's creed is this. If you kill it, you got to eat it. Oh, you know. Eat it, you eat it. Dog on right. Yeah. Chew on that one, son. <laughs> Pop, you, what you creating back there, Pop? <laughs> you got him talking about big booties and, and spirits and shit. All right, all right, all right. <laughs>
Hey, but, but the home front is doing their thing, and we doing our, our thing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>